How is carbonic acid, h 2 3 formed from carbon dioxide? Have you ever wondered how carbonic acid is created from carbon dioxide? It's a fascinating process that plays a role in both our environment and our bodies. Let's break it down step by step. Carbonic acid, which has the chemical formula h 2 3 forms when carbon dioxide gas dissolves in water. This reaction is essential in various fields, including chemistry and environmental science. When carbon dioxide comes into contact with water, a chemical reaction occurs. The carbon dioxide molecules interact with water molecules, resulting in the formation of carbonic acid. This reaction can be represented by a simple equation. Carbon dioxide plus water yields carbonic acid. The double arrow in this equation shows that the reaction can go in both directions. This means that carbonic acid can break back down into carbon dioxide and water. While this reaction is relatively slow, it happens naturally in many places, such as in the atmosphere, oceans, and even within living organisms. Once carbonic acid is formed, it is classified as a weak acid. This means it does not completely break apart in water. Instead, it partially dissociates to releases hydrogen ions and bicarbonate ions. This releases of hydrogen ions is what makes solutions containing carbonic acid slightly acidic. Bicarbonate ions can further dissociate to form carbonate ions and more hydrogen ions, but this usually occurs at higher pH levels. The formation of carbonic acid from carbon dioxide and water is central to many important processes. In the context of chemical nomenclature, understanding how h 2 3 is named and formed helps students connect the structure of the compound to its behavior. Carbonic acid is an inorganic compound, and its name follows the standard naming conventions for acids derived from nonmetals and oxygen. This reaction is also key to understanding ocean acidification. When carbon dioxide levels rise in the atmosphere, more carbonic acid forms in seawater, lowering the pH and impacting marine life. Additionally, this process is vital in biological systems, such as the regulation of blood pH through the carbonic acid bicarbonate buffer system. To sum it up, carbon dioxide dissolves in water, reacts to from carbonic acid, and then partially breaks down to releases hydrogen ions, making the solution acidic. This sequence of reactions is fundamental in chemistry education, especially when learning about acid-base chemistry and inorganic compound nomenclature.